right back again. Been on a good four or five hours, quite warm in there now. Right, we've had a go on them too, we've had a go on this, so we'll have a go on a couple more. I'll probably go around the room over three videos or something. Oh, there we go. Right, got a nudge. A nice little touch with the old lamps there. Go straight down the middle, you only get, you get five nudges. They light up, so we'll have a go on that, we'll press the tap. Some will go out randomly. Two's gone out. Three, eight, three. Never in a line, you've got to get a line, real or spin. Ten, that one. Real. Fifty-fifty. Oh. Ten poo. Uh, next spin could have been, could have been three. You've got to get through to get to, it's the token win of 60, 80 or a pound. Got some good sounds. That's your track mode. And one last tempo. The gamma points are 50 pounds. No gambles. Tempo. Tempo's no gamble. <laughs> the spaceships are 27 way. See if they all really in there. Anyway, there you go, that's that one. Uh, moving on a bit. Uh, Triumph. Black box, one of the last ones in this type of cab. In fact, I would guess the last one. They moved on to square buttons, but still on the old style cab. So quite a rare machine. When when I got this, I actually thought it was a bootleg, but it's not. It is a real, genuine machine. One of the first, I guess maybe even the first for bell fruit stepper reels. No electrical mechanicals, but this actually plays slower than the solenoid reel machines actually play faster than these. It's weird. So it's almost a step back, although it's a step forward. All right, nudges. Random stop six, so I can see the jackpot. So there's no point. If you get less than five, you can the gamble double or nothing. Uh, so we go one, two, three, four, five. <laughs> Sounds like it's never going to stop, doesn't it? But there you go, nice little two pound jackpot out of that. I'm in the top. This machine can actually go crazy sometimes. But yes, yeah, it's definitely a different, very unusual bell fruit. I've never seen any other bell fruits like that either. They're normally stacked. And there it is on either side. Oh, I thought that was gonna. Gamble. No, we don't. Put ten pins, see if that'll hold. Mm, that might hold. Sometimes a gambler comes out in you. Oh, another one. Oh, 
tokens of course right moving round to my oldest black box still in the electrical mechanical cabinet short one compared to the others right, there you go very short still very much an electrical mechanical feel but this has the all new and Bell Fruits very first black box technology. Oh, you go. That lights up. Oh, stick or twist on five. Twist. All right, okay. That's still lost. Basically, add up the seven, the seven, I mean, the six on the first wheel. So that's 20, obviously, bank wins with 20. Oh, there we go. Oh, we'll twist. That's even worse. Four to eight, the numbers are on the third. Yeah, 27 way bell fruits. ATP, but the clever amongst you would have noticed that was only four pulses because this one pays two tokens at a time. So only pulse four times, only pulses five for the jackpot. My guess the reason for doing that is to stop people converting these to cash because a lot of early machines were converted by cash by just putting the wires on, on the cash solenoid from the token one. But if you did that with this, it would chuck out only half the amount of 10 P's. So your jackpot would become, we'll take that, uh, did it? That one. See, that pays out four 10 P's, one at a time. <coughs> it's actually in really good condition, this machine. It's, it's immaculate. Oh, there you go, oh yeah. Oh, there you go. 50 quid and the bargain. Sometimes you can go nuts on the holding. Still lost. That's it. Oh, man! <laughs> that was the jackpot. You don't, uh, you don't often see that. No, no jackpot tune, sadly. But no, you don't often see that. Five pulses, ten tokens. Oh, I'll try that. 50 p no gamble on that. But. So I've got the jackpot off this one. There you go. Oh, it's got a seven, so I'm gonna stick. Oh, it's a freaking old site. They never hold. The gamble. Had a forty p. One last ten p in there. What well, I'll done too. Oh yeah, and a shout out to my mate uh, Kenny Ross, well Steve, um, in uh, Johnny's Amusements, Edinburgh. This is obviously the sister or brother machine, whatever you want to call it, to the nudge climber that you're sending me. So I'll have the, the two of them in the same cab, I believe it's in this type of cab. Maybe you could confirm or deny that. I know you sent some pictures, but Magic's camera again. So yeah, I should have the other machine, which is called Nudge Climber, which goes with this one. So that should be here shortly. Anyway, I'll stop this video here. So we've played Space Attack, Triumph, 21 up, 
and the video part one we've played Top and the Cracker, Big Apple, Comet Catcher, so another couple of videos. I'll do why not. So see you in a minute.